So today we had clinical rounds and basically they split us up into three groups. So my group, we got to do injections first. They taught us how to do three different types of injections. All the needles are so delicate and small. That was a tricky one for me personally. What was so great about this was they had things that you could practice on. Like they had a sponge, but then there was silicone around it that looked like skin. And so you could practice the different injections. And then the hardest part was the blood drawing. Basically they had a fake dog foot that was made out of rubber and hair and everything. Thing. So we got to practice drawing blood and it took a couple tries, but we eventually got it. That was challenging, but you get to practice a lot and then the TAs were there with you and actually helping you do it, which was really cool to see. The next activity that we did was patient prep. As the patients, they got these, it looked to be like cheese wall containers and they had drawn cats on it and they had put makeup on it, like a dirty belly. They taught us how you would strap it down to the operating table, how you have to shape a big area, not just the little part you're cutting open, how to properly clean it and how to have everything sterile for the surgery to begin. My group personally started off dressed in surgeon gear, so gloves, you got the mask, you get the hat, and we basically practiced being sterile and what it means to not contaminate things, and that was really tricky. <laughs> There's a lot that goes into it. Everything from tying up your hair, wearing a hairnet, how you're supposed to wash your hands. You learn how big of a deal it is to be sterile. It's not easy. There's so many things I didn't know. Before this, I had a lot of theoretical imaginations about what it would like to be a veterinarian and what it would be like to kind of practice being one, but I didn't really have any hands-on experience. With this, I was able to put hands-on activities and what it would actually be like to stories that I've heard. And that's something different that you can't really get. A lot of places. Especially in the medical profession, it's really important to know that you want to go into it. For me personally, I've wanted to be a vet, so now I get to come here, test the water, see how I feel about it, and I know I want to go into the vet profession. <laughs>